Hi everyone, let's build a Wormoth Telly. In this segment we'll be installing the string ferrules. They can be countersunk, but it, we won't be doing that in this instance. Here's a look at the ferrules I've selected for this build. Gold and black seemed like the thing to do at the time. We'll start off just pressing the ferrules in by hand. Try and put them as straight and level as possible. As we're driving them in, they'll tend to level themselves out a bit, but if you have them way off, it's not going to work. Again, you know, it's just finger pressure here. You're pushing uh, fairly hard, but uh, don't want to hurt yourself. Grab out the rubber mallet. And we'll also see a visit from my good friend, Jatoba. Jatoba is a very dense hardwood. I believe the Janka hardness is... 2690 compared with the swamp ash that we're working with here at 1320 it is quite a bit harder I'm going to take care not to get your wood block off center as you're hammering in the ferrules as it will definitely dent the wood of course any block of harder wood would be fine oak or poplar would be a common choice now as the ferrules are getting hammered home You'll notice a change in sound and feel. You can see the outer two ferrules have already been seated satisfactorily. Kind of hear the tonal change there as they bottom out. Again, we're using a rubber mallet. You're not hammering nails in the roof. Uh, you're, you're not killing cockroaches. You want to kind of take it easy. We're using this wood block to distribute the pressure from the hammer. Almost as if we're pressing them in. set. Let's take a quick look at our work. Looks pretty good. As you can see, the ferrules do protrude from the surface. That's just what we expected. If you'd taken a little reamer there, you could have countersunk them. You wouldn't be able to feel the lip here necessarily as you run your finger across. To be very careful to get each countersink even or it would look strange. Up next we're going to be installing the bridge and the bridge pickup. Thanks for watching. Hope you have a great day.